A Little River Academy eighth grader is dead after an ATV accident. Aiden Martin died from injuries last night at McLean Children's Hospital in Temple. Fox 44's Noelle Mendoza tonight is live in at Little River Academy with how locals are dealing with his death. Leslie Robert, Little River Academy community is mourning tonight. Along with Aiden's family, they plan to come together to help the family emotionally and financially. Amy Chase didn't know Aiden, but she has two children of her own at Academy. I actually heard about it from my daughter and then being a small town, it kind of travels around. You know, you hear about stuff like that. She was moved to help in any way she could. And I can't imagine being in a position like that and then have to worry about the financial burden of it. I mean, that's the last thing that they should have to worry about. They should be able to focus on being able to mourn and grieve the loss of him. She created the Aiden Martin Benefit Facebook page and is planning several fundraising events. I mean, that's something I'd want somebody to do if, if it were my family. Aiden received a brain injury after his ATV flipped on top of him on Friday. I just kind of, you know, heard from friends what was going on and praying for him. We uh, lost our own son six months ago. Um, so we know the pain. Amy Ronley knows all too well the pain of losing a son. Lean heavily into the Lord and um, let others around you comfort you. Take time to grieve. Um, take one day at a time. <laughs> and uh, it's a journey, but you will make it. The entire Little River Academy community is grieving. A statement to Fox 44 from Academy ISD Superintendent Kevin Sprinkle says the district is concerned about the emotional impact of this situation on the many students who knew and loved him. In response to this tragedy, we plan to have counselors and trained professionals available to respond to the needs of our students, families, and staff. It's just, I mean, it's a loss like no other, I'm sure. It's just a hard day for everyone. Now the family's collecting donations through the First United Bank and Temple. I'll have more information on the benefit as well as the fundraisers on our website, centexproud.com. Live in Little River Academy, Noelle Mendoza, Fox 44 News.